Welcome to Soma Kinetics. Uh, today I would like to talk about fascia. Fascia? What is fascia? Well, it's connective tissue. Connective tissue that connects basically everything in our body. There is superficial fascia right beyond, uh, below our skin and then there's fascia that goes three-dimensionally to the lower fascia. So fascia, or the Brits would say fascia. If you look at this model here, there are rubber bands and there are wooden dowels and they're totally suspended. Those wooden dowels represent actually our bones and our bones are connected via fascia or connective tissue so there's never going to be bone on bone unless you have some type of disease so what happens if you move one limb let's say this bone here this limb then something else happens with the whole structure. So no matter how you move, one affects the other one. So this is a very, very interesting concept developed by actually Buckminster Fuller. And a lot of research of fascia, uh, there's a lot of research out there and a lot of credit goes to Thomas Meyer and his anatomy trains and also Dr. Robert Schleip. Here is another way to illustrate the tensegrity, tension and integrity of our fascia. For instance, this wheel it is amazing because the hub of the wheel is suspended by the spokes. If one of those spokes is out of tune or is missing, the whole wheel will be unbalanced. And the same thing happens with your tendons and fascia per se, if one is out of balance, if the agonist and antagonist is out of balance, then eventually your whole body will be out of balance. That's what we call bad posture, possibly. So keeping your, your body in alignment is very, very important. The, uh, there's a science called uh, posturology, and we can see uh, sometimes you bring your neck forward. That's things we're doing on the other basis driving, computer work, reading the newspaper. So eventually, the posture becomes a habit. And by creating just the opposite movement, you are having the possibility to realign your posture on your neck, your lower back, middle back, upper back, hip. So I hope this gives you a general idea what tensegrity, tension, and integrity, what that does to your body and your Thank you.